Hello Leo, my awesome lions and lionesses, as I love to call you. Leo, it's Saturday where I am. I hope you're going to have a beautiful, relaxing weekend. Happy weekend to us, Leo. Leo, you want a soulmate reading to check up on the latest energies between you and your soulmate. I missed you guys. I hope you're doing wonderful. Uh, first, we're going to ask what's coming towards you, Leo. What do you be dealing with facing in your life and how you're currently doing on your soulmate journey? Second part of this video, we're going to ask about your soulmate. Whoever it is you're thinking of concentrating on while watching this video, whether you're currently in contact with them or not, first we're going to ask how this person is doing at this time and how they are currently relating to you <clears throat> emotionally, what's on their mind, what they're thinking, feeling at this time, especially in relation to you, Leo. Universe, please step in, show very clear and important messages. For the sign of Leo, for Leo's highest good, please. Universe, what's coming up for Leo in their life? And how is Leo currently doing on their soulmate journey? What's coming up for Leo in their life? And how is Leo currently doing on their soulmate journey? Oh, this one is looking at me very strongly as extra message. Very important, Leo. Okay, this is you feeling... Uh, alone in your soulmate connection, relationship, uh, lack of communication showing up here between you and your soulmate. And this is you, not sure if this is going anywhere, if, if, if it's going to get better or not, if it's going to progress or not. Um, yeah, it's like you've reached a certain level emotionally where you feel like it's not going anywhere. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, you're questioning this situation, this relationship, this connection. You really would like to progress in this situation, though, in this relationship, in this connection. Yeah. This is you missing your person. Let me see. Yeah, you really don't want this to end. No, you don't. You don't want this to end. You want this to progress, to be better. Yeah. Yeah. You want to put work into this, but you're trying to figure out what it is that your soulmate is feeling, thinking. Universe, please show us. Yeah, there are problems with communication showing up here. Universe, please show us what's coming up for Leo in their life and how is Leo currently doing on their soulmate journey? Yeah, you see, you're trying to figure out what it is this person of yours is feeling, thinking, planning. You have other soulmates out there interested in you. Yeah, you have people looking at you, interested in you. And you're trying to figure out, is there somebody else that you're supposed to be with? Or is this the person for you? You see, there are communication issues showing up here very strongly. This is you feeling very guarded emotionally in this situation. You're trying to protect your heart. Yeah, this is you being wise. And you feel like you are at a crossroads with this person and you need to make a decision. But you want to make a decision using your sound judgment logic. You don't want to be swayed by your emotions. Yeah. Ooh. You, you, you've you been through heartbreak in this situation. I'm so sorry you're going through so much. This is heartbreak. You've endured heartbreak in this situation. In this connection. Yeah. This is you feeling heartbroken, sad. You love this person a lot. Yeah, you really love this person a lot. In about two, three minutes, we're going to ask about your soulmate directly. Universe, please show us uh, what's coming up for Leo in their life and how is Leo currently doing on their soulmate journey? Yeah, you, you see, you, you really want to put work into this. If... Uh, your soulmate will reciprocate. You feel like this person is the one for you, or at least you were hoping this would end up being a long-term relationship. You see lovers showing up here. You have a lot of unanswered questions, fears, not knowing what it is that this person is thinking, feeling. You see, there are serious communication issues. There's not enough solid communication between you two. You're very drawn to this person, attracted to them, drawn to them. 
Wow, you guys, you guys definitely have soul contracts from past lifetimes. Uh, you're going to see each other again in future lifetimes, no matter what happens in this lifetime. This is a connection from many lifetimes between you two. You know each other on a soul level. Yeah, so this, this shows that you have extensive soul history together. Yeah, wow. I'm so sorry you're going through so much, Leo. Let's see what's going on here. And then we're going to ask about your soulmate. You really don't want to lose this person. But you feel like there's a lot things that are not being expressed to you or maybe even hidden, you see? Uh, problems with communication showing up here. Let's see, universe, please show us um, what's coming up for Leo in their life and how is Leo currently doing on their soulmate journey? Yeah, I see. You are waiting for this important communication to happen uh, between you two to clear the air. And you're wondering if you need to wait for them to reach out. Yeah, you're holding back communication. You're waiting for this person to reach out to you first. You're holding back even though you want to reach out to them. Oh, you love this person a lot. Yeah, you do. You love this person a lot, but you're not sure if their feelings uh, they feel for you match the feelings you feel for them. This is you holding back how you feel about them. This is you checking up on them, curious what's going on in their life, what they thinking, what they feeling, what they planning. <clears throat> yeah, let's see what's going on with your soulmate, Leo. Universe, please show us how is the soulmate of Leo at this time, and how is the soulmate of Leo towards Leo, especially emotionally? What's going on currently with the soulmate of Leo, and how is the soulmate of Leo towards Leo at this time? For some reason, two of them, not one. Wow. You see, this person is holding on to you, so they're not letting go of you. Yeah, this is them holding on to you. They either don't want to let you go or can let you go. Yeah, I see, they view you as marriage material, somebody significant in their life. <clears throat> they checking up on you as well. Curious what you're thinking, feeling. They're missing you. So you definitely are not together right now. Yeah, they're holding back as well. So both of you are holding back. They're wondering, is this relationship for them or is this somebody else for them? Yeah, I see both of you had the same messages. These repeating itself and these as well, just like you had. This person's wondering if this is it. They've reached certain level. Uh, with you and they're not sure how you're feeling so definitely communication is missing between you two you know please show us what's going on currently with the soulmate of leo and how is the soulmate of leo towards leo at this time this person is attractive they have other people interested in them but this person is kind of bored uh, it's like they're not really interested in other people right now. Ooh, you guys love each other. So this person loves you just like you love them, but you guys are not communicating. This person is not letting you go because of how they feel about you. This is them missing you, reminiscing of you. Yeah, past life connections between you two. You see, look at all these emotions they feel for you. Deep emotions, seven of cups, four of cups. King of Cups, Six of Cups, Nine of Cups. All emotions, feelings. They want to approach you. They do. They want to be a part of your life. Yeah, I see. It looks like it's not over between you two. The universe is going to give the two of you another chance to make amends, have better understanding of this situation or relationship, and then decide whether you want to have another new chapter together or not you see yeah you see they holding on to you because of their deep emotions they're not able to let you go yeah i see this person is hoping that there's going to be communication coming from you but they know if they don't hear from you they're going to have no choice but to initiate this communication this is unexpected communication messages yeah, I see this person wants to see you. Yeah, this is 
face-to-face -face communication, also apologies, peace offerings, gifts. This person wants to see you, give you something. That's the best way to communicate, face-to-face -face communication, yeah, to resolve any misunderstandings. Not None of that FaceTiming or emailing or text messaging. Face-to-face -face communication is the real way to have better understanding. Universe, please show us what's going on currently with the soulmate of Leo and how is the soulmate of Leo towards Leo at this time? They want to be brave enough to start something fresh. Yeah, what they really want is a long-term relationship. They don't want anything frivolous. Yeah. What's going on here? Something serious disconnected the two of you because the devil is showing up here. Yeah, you see? There's going to be a chance for communication between you two. But this person has a lot of distraction around them. It's like this person has some people that they need to let go of, disconnect from. Uh, yeah, people that are mm, uh, with heavy energy, uh, with drama, yeah, like this person is looking around and realizing that there are some people in their life that they need to let go of, yeah, some kind of toxic energy that they're dealing with from other people, wow, let me see. Let me see two more. Universe, please show us what's going on currently with the soulmate of Leo. Yeah, you see? Do you see this? There's something going on in this person's life. Yeah. And they see it. They know what it is that they need to let go of. Yeah. So this person is aware of what changes they need to make. Uh, who they need to let go of for their highest good. There's something toxic in their life. Uh, it's not from them. It's from somebody else, whether it's toxic relatives or toxic friends, whoever it is. Like they, they see it clearly, though. They can feel it. Yeah. Yeah, I see. This person is showing up as very attractive. Uh, they got it together with their job or business. They have jealousy around them. Yeah, like they have jealousy around them from other people. Yeah, you see? So this person sees very clearly who they need to walk away from for the highest good. People that bring them toxic energy. People that are chaotic. You see? Dramatic. You see? This person sees very clearly what they need to walk away from. Yeah, you see? They're trying to balance their life, balance their energy, do things right. Wow. This is powerful. Uh, Leo, we're going to go into your extended reading and ask about your soulmate's true, yeah, look at this, true love between you two. We're going to ask about your soulmate's true, genuine, long-term intentions and plans for you at this time. What are they planning long-term? Then we're going to ask what they currently hiding from you, what they have up their sleeve, whether they're hiding it on purpose or can communicate for whatever reason, but the universe feels you need to be aware of for your highest good. And of course, at the end, we're going to ask advice for you on how to best handle the soulmate connection at this time and anything else you need to know about your life, including new soulmates entering your life, new chapters, new beginnings in your life, also your health, finances, business, job opportunities, family matters, friendships, whatever it is you need to know, they'll show it at the end of the reading as well. So Leo, click on the extended link below this video in the description box below, and I'll see you there. Love you guys.